You know what that is. You know what this means. You know how we do. <laughs> you know how we do. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to All Things Hockey. And today, if I could find my bladular device, we have another mail day. And this one is featuring one eBay purchase. And I want to say one, two, three, four, five six instagram purchases and or trades uh stacking up a little bit of mail for the past few days uh just because i didn't want to do a four package mail day you know i want there to be a little bit of content for you guys to enjoy and today starting off um I'm a little worried about how this is or what this is so, um, oh, okay, so this is a, um, this is a little, little charity auction that I bought. It was like $2.50 and the proceeds went to charity. So, you know, why not? Got a, a little bit of Golden Knights stuff going on here. And... I wasn't sure if I was missing something, but they put <laughs> they put a Carlson base and an Ultra Pro, and uh, I've been seeing these Ultra Pro things all over the place recently. Like, are they gaining popularity? Like, I'm not a huge fan, if I'm being honest. They don't like fit. Like they're they're a little bit. I don't know if they're a little bit wider, but they're taller than a typical top loader. But main card being the Reed Duke Young Guns. Like I said, two fifty. Um, Free shipping goes to charity, so I feel like that's worth 250 and a little bit of money to charity personally. So I can't complain about that. Now this one, I'm pretty sure that this was a giveaway that I won, um, because the name didn't look familiar, um, when I was checking it out, uh, so I'm hoping that this is the giveaway, if it is, I also don't know what the cards are gonna be, <laughs> I won this giveaway, and then the dude messaged me, he was like, uh, you know, do you want your prize, and I was like, what are you talking about, and, you know, informed me that I won the giveaway, that I didn't even, you know, I enter giveaways all the time, I've never won one before, uh, trying to have no mishaps like I did with that poor Orlov card, I think it was, that got torn. And it looks like we uh, managed to uh, get that done. Alright, so, got two base cards, Kyle Terrace and a Jason Demers, and that is from 1819 Series 1. I like how they did that, it's like, big picture. Regardless... To the hits, we've got a Rasmus Ristolainen and UD game jersey, but it's got a seam there, so that's pretty neat. It's actually one of the nicer UD game jerseys I've ever seen. Uh, next up is a Star Rookies of Nicholas Patan. Patan? Pit, pit, pitten? <laughs> pit, I'm going to go with Patan. Patan. I don't know. Next is a UD canvas of Steve Mason. I'm a sucker for canvas cards. I just think they're... I just love them. You know, it's like a work of art. Next up is a Ryan O'Reilly Standouts um, from Tim Hortons. So that's pretty cool. 20, uh, 2020 to 21 Tim Hortons. So that's a very new card. And uh, being in the U.S., or at least where I am in the U.S., Tim Hortons does not exist. We got a Ty Delandria Young Guns, so that's that's actually pretty good, um, and it comes in the nice rookie card top loader. Uh, I can't remember what his price has gone to, but it's a free card, so I really can't complain about that. And a little bit of a uh, theme, we got a Steve Mason Between the Pipes autograph. So, I'll count that as a win. That was all free. That was all from a giveaway, so 
thank you so much to uh, the wonderful person. <laughs> I I didn't even bother looking because I, I talk to so many people on Instagram. I, I lose comments, or I don't lose comments. I lose um, messages, and there's no reason to look. But I appreciate it anyway. Um, that's a really good giveaway for the fact that I didn't even realize <laughs> that I won. Um, all right, so this one right here was a purchase. It's a, a mixture of Golden Knights and Capitals cards. Getting a little bit of a glare there, Cody Glass. There you go, bud. <laughs> and it says my name on it. My Instagram. Hashtag, that's my Instagram handle. Check it out. <laughs> I put a lot of effort into my Instagram. I actually, I, th I think I put more effort into my Instagram than I do here. If I'm being completely honest with you. Um, I post there every day, if not every other day, as well as uh, I do all my trades and purchases there through everything but eBay. All right, so what we got here is a Nathan Walker Young Guns, which I have, but you know the saying, there's no such thing as too many Young Guns. Another Thomas Heike, and a beautiful... Mark andre Fleury Black Diamond jersey card. Being that he is on the Knights now, uh, I can never turn down a Fleury card because he's such a beautiful man. Alright, so... Actually, what I'm going to do is set these aside so I can post those on Instagram um, for the wonderful people who sent them. Uh, Alright, so this one... We got her is, I'm seeing some Capitals cards. Alright, this one's going to be, uh, spoiler alert, there's a TJ Oshie. Oh, punch the camera. Alright. This is... The hardest pack of cards I've ever opened. Okay, jeez. So, starting off, we got a TJ Oshi, OPG Platinum, uh, I think, uh, Blue Rainbow. I don't know if it's like retro, but it is numbered 118 out of 149. We've got some of these. <laughs> Tom Wilson, um, with the, I think it's the blue, makes it special. I'm terrible with sp authentics authentic profiles of mark stone uh, a carlson with the blue oh and this was the main one a nick holden young guns which means i can check this man off of my list it was going to be very hard because i don't know where my list is but he doesn't have a lot of cards right now so he helped me out with this and a Black Diamond Ovechkin, numbered number two out of 249. Another super sweet card to add to the Ovechkin PC. Something I didn't have. So set him aside. And from the same person... <clears throat> we've got... So this one's pretty cool. Um, I traded him, I think it was a Headman UD game jersey for, it's going to look dumb, but it's an Ovechkin base card uh, from 06, 07. So I think that was year two. So the year after rookie, you'd be very surprised how much these go for. <laughs> um, they go for a few dollars, which is about the same as the Headman jersey. So that's really neat to uh, add to the collection. You know, I could have just bought a box of Victory. and It's it's about trading with people, you know. It's not about the money. Well, it is about the money, let's be honest. All right. <clears throat> Moving on up in the world. I see another standouts. Um... I'm not going to be as cautious with this one because there's a lot of tape. 
Is that Patrick Kane I see? Is that two Patrick Kanes I see? Oh, I forgot about this one. This one's really cool. Personally. I mean, I hope you think it's cool too. Because I think it's cool. So we got two Patty Kane standouts. As well as... Bang. Tom Wilson Future Watch. Back when they were numbered out of twelve ninety nine instead of nine ninety nine, but um, oh, I left a little sliver. Either way, I got this for a very good price. I think I paid seventeen, maybe less, maybe more. I can't, you know, you know how this shit works. I can never remember. But Tom Wilson Future Watch, being that he is another PC of mine, so so happy to finally have that in the collection. Um, you know, I'd rather support a friend on Instagram than some stranger on eBay. <laughs> and lastly, to end this... Hmm. I just love how I always forget. <laughs> I always forget what I do with trades. Alright. So... Cut this tape off. There's a little, uh, little bit of tape. A little bit more tape. There we go. All right. So, another card very much needed with some tape on it is a Trevor Van Riemsdyk Young Guns, which means I can cross him off of the list for the roster set, which puts me so close to finishing. Next up, is a Silver Scripts, I want to say that's what they call him. Uh, yep, Silver Script TJ Oshi when he was on the Blues. It's unfortunate that I feel like he has more stuff from the Blues than he does on the Capitals, but what are you going to do? Oh, dropping stuff. We've got, oh jeez, a Lars Eller scorecard, since he is also on the Capitals now. And lastly, yeah. A man who is no longer on the Capitals. We got ourselves a Braden Holtby artifact with a very bad numbers. <laughs> Look at that. It's all crooked and off-centered. and But, you know, 214 out of 499 for a beautiful Braden Holtby. Starting to miss this man. But, you know, rookie goalies, Vanacek and Sammy, they're really, they're really starting to get there. Both of them have shutouts. Both of them have been winning games pretty frequently. So I really, I shouldn't be complaining. But I, you know, I'll find something to complain about. <laughs> Either way, thank you guys so much for joining me today. If you are interested in selling or trading any cards, hit me up on Instagram at ATHYouTube like you saw earlier. We're going to be doing a 500 follower giveaway on there as soon as we hit 500. Um, so that's coming really soon. So by the time this video is up, I may already be there. Um... If I'm not, hit that follow button. If I am, get ready for 600. Every 100 increment comes really quickly for some reason. Uh, I've been really, really doing well on there. So I appreciate you if you are already following me. Hit that subscribe button if I haven't said so. I'm pretty cluster-brained, if that's even a word. Either way, thank you so much for joining me today, and I will see you in the next video.